Hey guys, welcome back to another video of SQL 50 lead code series. So today problem statement is last person to fit in the bus. Okay, this is your table. Uh, table name is Q and we have four columns. Uh, person ID, person name, wait and turn. All right. Let's see the problem statement. So there is a queue of people waiting to board a bus. However, the bus has a weight limit of 1000 kilograms. So there may be some person who cannot board. So you need to write a solution to find the person name of the last person that can fit on the bus without exceeding the weight limit. Let's see the uh, example here. So this is your table data. Uh, if you see carefully, turn is not sorted here. Okay. So the first thing you need to do is you need to sort the table based on the turn. If you see output, we are getting at John Cena. So let's see the explanation. So first person to board on the bus is Alice, whose weight is 250 kilogram. Second person is Alex, whose weight is 350. So as of now, we have 600 kilogram of people boarded on the bus. So how much we can fit? We can fit only 400 and John Cena unfortunately is the third people to go on the bus whose weight is 400 kilograms so that sums up to 1000 kilograms so mary cannot get a chance to go on the bus because uh, the quota is full now okay so let's try to write a query to uh, get to the result uh, so first thing what we can do is let's take this sql schema let's try to do inside our sql server management studio to explain you line by line how the things are working uh, we do not need this okay so let's execute this table script first so our table has been created Oh, uh, we do not need this. Now let's execute this part to insert some data into this table. Okay, so let's start from Q. All right, so we have data now. So we are going to use the concept called running total and sub query. So first, let's see how we can get the running total or running weight. You can say. So we will be using function sum weight, right? After this, we need to apply over, and then we need to make this data sorted by turn as well, right? So order by turn. We can call it as running weight from the table name which is going to be q let's try to see what we are getting as of now our running weight has been calculated here we'll be using subquery okay so we can write select person name okay we can put this everything inside a query subquery we can call it as q and we can write another condition where running weight is equal to thousand okay so let's see whether this is giving us the result as zone cena okay okay we are missing from here so if you see we are getting john cena as the result so let's try to copy and paste this query into the lead code and let's try to see whether it is passing the test cases so let's run this code so case one has been accepted let's try to submit it and see whether it is passing for all the test cases we have So there is no possibility that weight will always be equal to 1000 kilograms. So it can even be less than 1000 kilograms. So let's go to SQL query and try to fix the query. So first thing to make here is less than equal to 1000. Okay. Uh, if I execute it, what we are getting? We are getting three names. Okay. It is giving me all the three names. If we add here order by running with descending. So I think John Cena should go at the top. All right. So John Cena has gone to the top. Now we can easily take top one. So this should give us John Cena. That's good. Let's try to copy and paste this query here. Now let's try to execute and see whether it is passing for the test cases, both the test cases we have. Okay, so it has passed for both the test cases. Now let's try to submit it and see whether it is passing for all the test cases now. All right, so it has passed for all the test cases. 